wars bring historic change and the collapse of empire as chairman mao used to say there can be no construction without destruction in order to build the new we must destroy the old what is the nature of power which is getting redistributed is wealth the only and most significant aspect of power de dollarization the almighty dollar has been weaponized by the united states the biggest strength of america is not military power yes you think that military might it's your soft power yes your universities yes your science your technology the democratization of the global order it should no longer be controlled by washington london brussels or the g7 they still have the cold war mindset containment of china combating russia russia more new bases aukus quad asian nato we need more economic connectivity trade and investment what china is offering belt and road initiative what putin is saying eurasian initiative in the propaganda war the west is winning and leading what does this changing world order mean for pakistan can you identify what are the key challenges that uh, state and society of pakistan is likely to face a huge opportunity for pakistan for regional economic connectivity the afghan war has ended after 42 years so you have peace there and we were in the eye of the storm for since 79 cpec an opportunity to make pakistan the hub of regional connectivity tajikistan turkmenistan uzbekistan kazakhstan kyrgyzstan they're looking up to pakistan landlocked countries want to be land linked through gawadar port and the bully on the block the guy next door mr modi the four letter word he's been cut down to size by the indian electorate the mini cold war is being lost by india in the south asian region